Hi, I'm David Miller. Uh, I come from New Jersey in the United States, outside New York, but I've been living in Copenhagen for 35 years. Uh, and I work with climate change communications. Uh, what I've gotten out of the Congress here is that there's a lot of aspects uh, to care. We talk about care in terms of engineering, we talk about it in terms of climate change, and of course things like healthcare that we're used to. Uh, what I see in 2027, looking back, I feel that Ecology of Care should become an academic program and it should be taught around the world, both as a course in and of itself and as maybe a one day lesson, for instance, for an engineering student or a philosophy student. Um, so it also becomes part of other subjects. And um, it's very successful and I wish Ecology of Care and the whole program the best of luck. Hi, this is Earl Taylor from Australia and it has been um, a delight in so many, many ways to have the pleasure of being a moderator, stroke facilitator of this 2016 Ecology of Care Congress. And uh, from a moderator's point of view, what I've been so terribly impressed with is the diversity and the richness of the communication and the contributions from the official presentations, but also equally the um, playful onness, the the let's get in the moment and contribute from every one of the participants, stroke contributors at the Congress. So it truly has been a delight. And I'm picturing that in 10 years time when we look back on an ecology of care, then we will see its roots and influences stretching out into a whole range of things from university courses to government departments to corporations and indeed perhaps to families and, and individuals. So it has been an absolute delight to be part of something that uh, is truly world changing. Um, and the people are absolutely wonderful. So much so that there are many, many people here that I've met that I want to continue to have a conversation with and I think that's really important. So for me the ecology of care can be a strategy for uh, integrated thinking and a new way to kind of measure and understand progress across the world. Really what we should be thinking about is some new guidelines for behavior, both social behavior, economic behavior, and how we relate to the natural world. And I think the ecology of care can really be a step towards that, where we have this new measure of progress that looks at how we as humans interact with others and the natural environment in a very, very different way. For me, this is really about long-term sustainability and a, a new paradigm for, for social progress and interaction. For me, the conference has been all about relationships, understanding people's perspectives, different thoughts, very deep thinking, intellectual stretch, and a time where I understand there is so much care, there is so much going on, but more than anything else, this conference makes me realize we have to get on and do something. I want to know what it is we're going to do and by whom. So in 2027, I want to look back and see a successful social enterprise working globally using a business model that's sustainable and is people focused, but that has begun to achieve a, a depth of care, both for self, others, and the world, that makes a real difference, a tangible difference. I'm Anna Sørensen. I'm a researcher from Odense in Denmark. My field of work is electronics, robotics, and welfare technology. I'm here because uh, Ian's work and the ecology of care is uh, adding a lot of perspective to my work. Uh, my line of work can be explained as integrating care into technology or developing technology that can help care for people. So <clears throat> studying and understanding and explaining the concept of care is really important to help develop technology and products that can uh, fulfill this, uh, this need in society. The conference has opened my eyes to a wider breadth of views and improved my understanding of the possibilities if we care. In 2027, the Ecology of Care will be an organisation that will be known worldwide as the model to follow, with a vibrant membership of countries, academ academics, business and social groups, sharing and developing the concept of care further. 
Hi, I'm Steffi. I come from Belgium and I joined IAN uh, since June as a project manager of Ecology of Care Congress 2016. Uh, I, I really enjoyed uh, working with IAN. The, the people that he has brought together here is truly amazing. Uh, so I wanted to get some more people involved. So I got uh, six volunteers and one of them here is Anna. Anna, why did you uh, get involved in, in this project as a volunteer? Uh, I would say it's uh, to become a part of something greater, uh, to meet uh, extraordinary people from different fields, and uh, yeah, that, great, that's great. basically. Uh, what about? Do you have a favorite one that you met so far? Uh, yeah, there was a speech from uh, Harriet uh, Bolkind. I uh, really liked her um, everyday approach to the topic, and what small changes we can make to create yeah, and. Better world. Yeah, better world. <laughs> that's it for us. <laughs> Thank you.